Hello everyone. So <laughs> today I'm gonna teach you how to find the middle of a Photoshop document. Okay, so I already did a video about this. You can go check it out. That one's better than this one. Okay, so but because everybody liked it, I'm gonna do a second part, right? So what we're gonna do? We're gonna go down here. We're gonna select the line tool. Just make sure that the fill is a color that you can see. For example, this one, and we're gonna use the old trick of just doing this honestly like go from here go here and that's the middle <laughs> I'm not trolling I mean like honestly this is a legit way to find the middle I think because sometimes all you need is like okay you can just merge these two layers together this is like a really interesting way to do it just find it's just a guide, right? You just have this guide. You can take it away whenever you want. And it's honestly useful. For example, if you have some letters here, for example, it's the my channel name, and I want to put this totally in the middle. There's other ways that I could do it, but I can just use this guide and be like, okay, this is the middle, right here. There you go. Right? And it could also be helpful if you had, like, not necessarily a whole document but let's say that you had like a part here and you want to find the middle of this well you can just do the same exact thing right let's go from here to here let's go from here oh sorry the stroke the field is the same color so we're not going to see it right so you go from here to here here to here and there you go that's the middle you can just merge these two layers together so it's just one and rasterize it so it's just lines and this is a pretty good estimate well it's not an estimate it's actually the, the exact middle right it's the the actual middle of the thing right so you can just use that as a guide and be like okay I'm gonna put it there just the middle and you can just get rid of it you know delete this layer and that's it so I hope that was helpful I know it was just a little like obvious or maybe not man. maybe some people didn't know that trick uh, I learned that trick in school I guess in like geometry or something I don't know but it can also be applied in Photoshop as you can see so yeah because everybody liked the last video I decided to make it a second part is another way to do it and thank you for watching so um, in my channel I have a lot of tutorials for flash and Photoshop so if you wanna check them out make sure to go check them out <laughs> to learn more so yeah see you in the next videos bye